Lisa. How's it going? Um, okay, this is a part two. Um, in my last video, and I'll put the, the link below, um, I did an unboxing. I got two new fountain pens um, for my birthday, and I demoed the writing sample with the, um, the Pelican that I, I purchased um, on the last video. But I did not demo, uh, this is the Pelican, and I did the unboxing and just kind of a quick peek. Um, but I did not um, do a demo of the Conklin Crescent uh, Fill pen that I have. This is a limited edition that I bought from Goulet Pens and it is now sold out. Um, beautiful writing instrument. Um, and so I wanted to do a deeper dive onto this particular fountain pen. Um, and its writing capabilities. Um, in addition to buying this fountain pen because I bought it with the special that's going on right now with Goulet, I also got this free bottle of Mont Verde um, Copper Noir ink as well. So I wanna do a really quick writing example of that. And then uh, one of the Christmas gifts that I received from a very generous relative was additional writing um, uh, samples, sorry, samples from, from Goulet as well of various inks. So I think these are all um, sheening inks. So I'm going to probably do this one since there's several of them and I don't want this meet, um, video to be a really long one. Um, I will probably do these separately since I've got quite a few samples as you can see here. So let's get on with it. Um, like I said, this is a... Conklin. It is a limited edition and I bought with it a additional nib. Um, I'm kind of curious about these nibs that they have with Conklin. I've got another um, pen that does have different swappable nib, um, nibs on them and I really do like them. But um, in this case, I got the Conklin and then I got a, should have had a rose gold nib. Yes. So I've got this rose gold nib as well. Um, I'm not gonna probably swap out the nib because I'm gonna just use the one that came with it, but this is a rose gold uh, unit, which is a number six, and it's just really, it's really beautiful. Um, nib that you can get um, to switch out your um, your fountain pen nibs that you get at Goulet for the, Con uh, for the Conklin in particular. So I've got that one. So this is a rose gold crescent, um, fountain pen, crescent filled fountain pen, and a limited edition, and this is a 1.1 millimeter stub, and I love 1.1 stub um, nibs. Um, gives you that old school kind of calligraphy style without all the work of like knowing how to write in calligraphy. So I wanna demo that, and I wanna demo it with this Copper Noir. Um, I'm gonna move this sheet aside. And what I've done is I've bought a, um, a Leuchtstrom personal size notebook that I'm using now to um, basically swap out all of, the, all of my fountain pen inks. And so I'll be writing in this so that I can just kind of keep this where I'm keeping all the other ones. Um, so let's see here. I'll take my little blotting sheet to the side. And we're gonna go ahead and unscrew this. Whoa, look at that color. It's just beautiful. Copper Noir. Um, and I think you can go ahead and get these inks. I don't know if they're only with the promo or if you can buy them um, separately. So this is um, a Mount Verde. Just go ahead and fill this in. I don't have my Q-tip swabs with me handy. So I'll just kind of color this in. I did this with Q-tips before. So this is the Conklin. Ah, it helps if I know how to spell it, right? Conklin, sorry. Crescent fill. 1.1 1 .1 stub nib. Beautiful writing pen. Oh, I love how this writes. Yeah, this is gorgeous. This is absolutely, um, this is a Mount Verde. 
Monte Verde, Copper, Noir. Look. Oh my God, that is absolutely gorgeous. Look at that color. Um, I don't think it has any sheening capabilities, but um, get my little thing out of here. But it's absolutely gorgeous ink. And I love the 1.1 stub nib. I think the other one that I got in rose gold is a um, fine point nib. So I'll, I'll hold off on doing that one till later. I'm just rinsing off the pen. Um, so I just wanted to share with you this because I did not um, do this part of the writing sample in my reveal. Um, but I absolutely, I love this color. It's perfect for fall right now. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to give you a really quick review. Um, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you would like to see the other ink samples, let me know. Otherwise, thank you for your time and have a great day. Take care. Bye.